Health care is one of many issues demonstrators brought up at anti-war rallies across the country last weekend. State of Events Derek Highsmith was at San Francisco's March Saturday, where the spotlight was on the wars in Iraq and Afghanistan. It's been seven years since the 2003 invasion of Iraq, but Saturday's anti-war rally proved the wounds are still fresh. Imperialism is not something that just started today. This war that we are talking about today is a consequence of the founding of the American empire itself. America is the greatest, worst empire that has ever existed on the face of the earth. I'm not a big Obama supporter, but I just think that, you know, we got to give him the benefit of the doubt, especially when he campaigned on the idea that he was going to get us out. Now we're not out. Obviously, he's had a chance to rethink it and uh, knows that, you know, uh, you know, that's the sort of change we don't need right away. Demonstrators think the money could be put to better use. The main reason that there are no funds for education is because of the enormous military spending in Iraq and Afghanistan. Demonstrators want more money to go to local governments, but events like these have the opposite effect. Protests following the 2003 Iraq invasion cost San Francisco taxpayers nearly a million dollars in as little as a day. But San Francisco police have since reorganized their response to such events to save money. Saturday's march proved their efforts work, resulting in a peaceful protest. It's nice to see people um, being peaceful, but still stating their beliefs. Some of it's way over my head, but I'm all about the education part. Derek Highsmith, State of Events, San Francisco.